Hi guys, Misha Crossing here with more Pokemon Moon. I am on Route 3 right now. Um, I don't want to use another <laughs> repellent, thank you. Um, I am on my way to battle the Kahuna of this island. This guy, this trainer won't battle me until I've beat all the other trainers on Route 3. So I need to go battle some more of them. Oh, here's another rising star. I'll draw out the power of my partner Growlithe by giving it an item to hold. I swear to god, if this rising star has a name of someone else that I know. Rising star Joshua. I do know a Joshua. My cousin's name is Joshua, but that's still not in the group of friends that it was going along before. <laughs> Aw, he's just got the one. The one little Growlithe baby. My cutie fly's gonna wipe the floor with you. Oh, except her HP's very low. <laughs> I didn't realize. Um, okay, yeah, I'll just switch Pokemon. Uh, uh, let's do Growlithe versus Growlithe. Why not? <clears throat> And they're both level 13. Oh, that Growlithe um, doesn't have Intimidate. He's got another ability. It's not very effective. Hmm, I wonder why, buddy. Okay. He's Bite on him. It's effective. And he's just using Ember again. Not listening to anything that's uh, going on on his screen, clearly. Low. Oh, he flinched and couldn't move. Nice. Way to go, buddy. Ember, again, with this. Gosh. I'm just gonna bite him one more time and it'll be over. Here we go. Bye bye. Oh, very close to leveling up. Oh, Dartrix leveled up. Oh, I need to use Dartrix in battle. I'll use Dartrix next. I haven't used him since he uh, evolved from Rowlet. Okay, let me switch my Pokemon around here. I think I will heal Cutie Fly. I don't know why I just scrolled down. There we go. That's good. Okay. Oh, an item! What are you? A super potion. Yay. Oh, that- oh, that's not a trainer over there in the top right. That's just that guy that gave me something earlier. Oh, what does this sign say? Iki Town. Okay. Is there anything? No, okay. Sorry. Thought I saw something on the map. Okay, there's gotta be- oh, here's another trainer to fight. Oh, nope, not a trainer. Hey kid, you're a local, right? From around here? I've got a favor I want to ask someone, like you. Please, you've got to help me. We'll see what it is. Oh, thanks kid, that's the Alola spirit. You're all so nice here. I'm actually here on my honeymoon and my beautiful bride has completely fallen for this Pokemon you have here called Rockruff. She just can't get enough of its curled little tail and that rocky fur around its neck. I've heard you can find them in Ten Carat Hill, but I'm really lost here. Could you go to Ken Ten Carat Hill and catch one for me? If you do, then I can check out its information in your decks, and then I can go catch one myself. I'll even pay you for your hassle. So that's similar to what some woman told me about the cutie fly, but I don't know- Oh, I didn't really want to bring up the map. <laughs> My bad. Uh, do I not have a list of little side quests that I've accepted? It wouldn't be in my Pokédex. I don't know why I'm going in here. Um, But yeah, I don't have a list of my side quests. That's a bummer. I feel like that should be a thing. Ooh, some berries. Oh, there's a Pokemon feeding on the berries and it leaped out at you. Cool. Huh. What is it? Oh, a cra crab brawler. Crab brawler. A crab brawler. Cool. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> I don't want to kill you though. Um, I want to catch you. Add you to my Pokédex. Uh, Leafage is probably the like lowest power one that I have. Oh no. Okay, good. <laughs> Look at his eyes. <laughs> One's like halfway drooped down. That's funny. Oh no, he's calling for help. Oh, it didn't answer. Okay, good. 
because I can't throw a Pokeball when there are two Pokemon in front of me. Pro tip. Or really, basic tip. <laughs> Stay in the Pokeball. Stay- yes! Grub Brawler was caught. Yay. None do one experience. Growlithe grew to level 14. Wow, everybody's evolving. They're not evolving, leveling up. I've been saying that. I've been saying everyone's evolving. I should be saying everyone's leveling. I say the stupidest stuff sometimes. Okay, his data is being added to the Pokédex. Registered. Um, it punches so much its pinchers often come off from overuse, but they grow back quickly. What little meat they contain is rich and delicious. <gasps> Why? Why would you tell me that? I don't want to know that. Uh, no, no nickname, and I will just send him to my box. Don't really want to use him, but he's cool. Got a chesto berry. I know, I'm gonna get more. A citrus berry. And a lepa berry. Thank you. Ooh, a thing. A nest ball. Ooh, look, there's a cave down there in the uh, lagoon. Can't wait to use surf so I can get in there. Okay. Oh no, I ran into something right at the edge of the grass. <laughs> Maybe it's something new. Nope, Spiro. I'm gonna run away from it. <laughs> Seen a couple too many Spiros. Run, run. Alright, so that's not a trainer. That's someone with a side quest. Alan challenge marker. Explore the meadow carefully. You may find that there's more to it than meets the eye. Okay. Um, oh, I'm back on Route 1. Cool. Definitely don't need to fight anything in here. Everything is... Too low of a level for me. Oh, I bet I can go back and battle that, uh, that guy now. Sorry. I'll cut to being in front of that, uh, trainer on Route 3 to battle. <laughs> Alright, here we are. Hopefully he will battle us now. So you've defeated all the trainers along Route 3, have you? You have shaken me from my calm repose. My heart was still water. Was a still water, but no longer. Shall we start? Let's have a soul-shaking battle. Okay. Oh, I should have looked at my Pokemon. Before I accepted the battle, probably. Oh well. You are challenged by Ace Trainer Makana. Makana. Makana, probably? Aw, he has a rock rough. Hi, buddy. Oh yeah, I got Dartrix out front. I might hit Rockruff once. And then go. Yeah, let me look at Razor Leaf. I don't think I've used Razor Leaf yet. Maybe I have. I can't remember. <clears throat> oh yeah, I think I have used it once or twice. Oh gosh. One hit. One hit KO. Oh, that's getting sore again. <sighs> Oh, Makuhita leveled up. Um, oh, about to send out Slowpoke. Yeah, I'll switch out Pokemon. Mine as well. Um, let's bring Makuhita out here. Has been out in a while. And here comes Slowpoke. <laughs> this is a cute battle happening right now. Uh... Yeah, I'll use Fake Out. First move. Oh no! The opposing Slowpoke <gasps> held up its red card and... What? Oh, it brought Cutie Fly out. Okay. <laughs> but Slowpoke flinched and couldn't move. I will use... Oh, what does Silver Wind do again? I already forgot. Um, this may also raise all the user's stats. Okay, let's try this one. Haven't used it yet. Oh, pretty. That was pretty, pretty nice. Pretty good amount of damage. Uh-oh. 
Okay, Cutie Fly will use Struggle Bug. I think that sounds like a good one to use. Lower special attack some too. Yeah. Uh oh. That one's gonna be kind of strong, right? No, not too bad. Okay. Uh. Let's do Fairy Wind. Yeah, let's just go through all the moves. <laughs> Oh, that one did not do much at all. Oh no, I'm gonna fall asleep. Oh, it just grew drowsy. Okay, so I've got one more move in me. I will use Struggle Bug and hopefully- Oh no! I was gonna say hopefully in the battle, but then he goes and uses a potion. Okay. Lowered my special attack and now I'm asleep. <sighs> it's okay, cutie fly. I'll switch you out. I will bring out Meowth. Sorry, cutie fly. <laughs> Go have a little nap. You deserve some rest. You did good. She got dragged out here, not even knowing she was gonna battle. Just got pulled out unaware. Okay, I will- Okay, let's use Meowth's Z power. Why not? Break- Oh wow, they're all breakneck blitz. <laughs> Yeah, I'm thinking about giving my character bangs. She looks a little funny without bangs. If she had like a good side part going, but it's a middle part and it looks kind of weird. Oh, Meowth is going to just run him right over. There he goes. <laughs> oh no! He has literally one HP left. <laughs> Ugh, that's so frustrating. But there we go. He fainted. <laughs> that was fun. Yeah, definitely need to care for my Pokemon. Um, nobody leveled up, but that's okay. To think that you've wounded my pride, which is harder than diamonds. <laughs> oh, I received 952 for winning. Awesome. Oh, look. Meowth is all dirty. He's holding his hands out like human. Groom me. Love it. He's so sassy. You did a good job, buddy. Kind of. Except that you left <laughs> the slowpoke with one HP. Which is super silly. Alright. I wonder if, um... Oh, I should have gone to... Cutie Fly. To heal her of her... Asleepness. My heart feels as light and clear as the blue sky that appears after a storm passes through. This is proof of the battle between your team and my own. A red card. Take it, my strong friend. Yay. You open the item's pocket, put the red card away. The effects of the red card are as I illustrated to you in battle. You will likely find other trainers like me on the roots of Alola, searching for strength. Challenging them with your Pokemon would not be a bad reason to take a journey. Let's see what the red card does. I mean, it just pulls a Pokemon out. Um, um, oh, here's the red card. An item to be held by a Pokemon when the holder is hit by an attack, the attacker is removed from battle. Hmm. I mean, I might as well give it to somebody. Uh, I don't think I have... Do I have Pichu holding something? I don't think so. Cool. All right, so now we are gonna go back to town and battle the Kahuna. We'll definitely have to heal my Pokemon first. We are gonna go down through Route 1 and then back up into town. Oh, I hear Pokemon somewhere, but I need to get to where I'm going. Oh, Lily and Kakuli. I'm looking forward to seeing what moves you and your Pokemon will pour your soul into now that you've gone and cleared your first trial, Misha. It's true. I'm not a trainer, so I'm sure I don't really understand how hard it must have been. But even I think it's a great achievement. So does Nebby. The Kahuna is strong, cousin. He's a trainer who can use fighting-type Pokemon to the fullest. Might not be a bad idea to work on those flying or psychic-type moves. Thanks, Kakui. Thanks for the tip. Oh, there he is. Standing there waiting for me. 
We should probably meet up with Kahuna Hala. I'd guess he's around town somewhere. Yeah, he's literally right there. Um, is there no Poke Center in this town? Since it's so small. Uh, I'll talk to him and see what he's what he's got to say. Congratulations on clearing your trial in the Verdant Cavern. Good work. I suppose you're here to battle the Kahuna? You think you and Dartrix are ready for me, Misha? Actually, no. I should go... Home, right? Is this my house? Where's my house? Where do I live? Oh, this isn't my house. What are you doing? It said that the ancient peoples rode over the waves and the seas together with their Pokemon to settle the Alola region. Oh yeah, I don't live in this town. I live before Route 1. <laughs> um, I just wanted to heal my Pokemon. Um, I can do that with uh, the items I have. It'll be faster than going back to either to town or to ha my house. Um, let's see. And Growlithe needs to be healed some, definitely. Alright, everybody's got pretty good HP. Um, I'm going to- oh no, he has that item. Let me give you something, I don't know what. Sure, Ornberry. Oh no, not use it. Just give it to him. <laughs> Oh, what does the citrus berry do? Um, it can restore its own HP by a small amount during battle. Okay. Is Cutie Fly holding anything? No. Give you something too. Okay. Oh, it shows you. It has a little symbol on there if they're holding something. Cool. Okay, so I will give Growlithe a berry as well. Okay, now we are ready to battle the Kahuna, I think. Do I have everybody in order? Yeah, definitely want Dartrix out first. Because he's got the flying type move. Yes, definitely. Let's do it. Oh, sorry. I'm kind of far away from the microphone. I just noticed. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, gosh. <laughs> he is... Intimidating, I have been expecting you. Allow me to properly greet the young adventurers embarking on the, their island challenge. I am Hala, the Kahuna of Malay Malay, Malay Malay Island. Shall we begin? The final trial here on the island will be a Pokemon battle against me, the Kahuna. It is known as the Grand Trial. Well, Misha, you have been entrusted with the Sparkling Stone by Tapu Koko. Now show me you and your partner Dartrix and your team's full power. Old Hala here will be all... We'll also be going all out. Let the grand trial begin. Oh, how fun. You are challenged by Island Kahuna Hala. He's got three Pokemon. Oh, Mankey. Mankey. <laughs> oh, Dartrix is gonna take care of him. Level 14. Okay. That's an alright level. Oh, look at Peck here. Super effective. I don't think I'll kill him in one hit. Maybe two. <gasps> oh, that did get him in one hit. And it was a critical hit. Nice. Oh, who's he gonna send out next? Oh, Makuhita. Um, I mean, I might as well switch Pokemon. It's gonna be so easy with Dartrix. You know? Let's do Makuhita against Makuhita. <laughs> and they should... I guess they're around the same level. Oh no, she's 17. He's probably gonna be lower. Yep, 14. Okay, so I've still got quite an advantage. Um, I should use Fake Out since it's the first move. Oh no! He used Fake Out before I could use Fake Out. <laughs> um, Alright, Force Palm, let's go. No, stop! Oh, my accuracy fell. Oh, okay, good. Still hitting him. I should... I'll use Arm Thrust. But he's attacking my accuracy again. That meanie. 
I was about to say, that didn't do much. I forgot it hit multiple times. Nice! Hit four times! <gasps> Five times! Wow. Good girl. <laughs> we are just breezing our way through this um, Kahuna battle. Oh, Crab Brawler is what it was. Um, let's send Cutie Fly out there. That'll be fun. Go, Cutie Fly! There's so many pretty little girls on my team. <laughs> I love it. Oh, Crab Brawler, look at them, them. He's got his fists up for us. Um, oh yeah, Fairy Wind will be super effective, but the two bug type moves, not very effective. Um, oh, he's at level 15. Cool. So that'll be a bit of a challenge. I might as well use Fairy Wind and do the most amount of damage I can to him. Ooh, Pursuit. Oh no. Not very effective, but that was really intimidating. <laughs> he like jumped up right in front of her. Ace. Oh, he's Leer. He's not actually attacking. So I'm gonna. I think this one will. We'll get him. Yep, sure did. Crab Brawler fainted. And I defeated the Kahuna. Cutie fight. Cutie fly leveling up. Awesome, yeah. Good speed, good HP, good special attack. I like cutie fly, alright. You defeated Island Kahuna Hala. Whoa, well played. I received 2,400 for winning. Yes. Oh, look how dirty she is. Need to brush all this sand off of her. Oh, that's cool. She's standing right in front of that big. Um, fire pit back there. <laughs> oh, come on. Almost clean. Yes. Oh, wait, no. There's a little bit more right there <laughs> on her cheek. There we go. And, of course, you deserve a treat. Eat up. Did good. And I should also take care of cutie fly I would say I used cutie fly a bit <laughs> what is it she had a question mark above her head for a second that was funny feed her a bean give her a little pet all right good job guys go team go see what the kahuna has to say now. I'm sure he's got some speech for me about how I'm a great trainer. I'll go on to do great things on the other islands, etc, etc. Hmm. The results came as no surprise to me. What a fine trainer. And what fine Pokemon too. Oh! Tapu Koko! <gasps> oh! And our mighty Tapu Koko agrees. Perhaps Tapu Koko is hoping that a day may come when you will grow strong enough to battle it as well. Yes, please. <gasps> Except the Z-Crystal. It allows trainers to share their power with their partner Pokemon. What Z-Crystal is it? Oh, is it a... Oh, it's a, a... Of course it's a fighting one. Duh. That's cool. Um... Yeah. Oh, Grand Trial complete. Nice. That's a cool uh, gift for completing... The grand trial for battling the the island Kahuna, getting a Z crystal for the type of Pokemon that they tend to battle with. Cool. If you ever wish to use the fighting type Z power, move your arm like this, then bend your hips like this and pose. <laughs> yeah, that's intense. I gotta give that one to uh, Makuhita. You have cleared all the trials of this island, <laughs> the first of Alola's islands. The stamp is proof of your accomplishments. With it, Pokemon up to level 35, even those you receive in a trade, will obey you. Yes. The moon in the daytime, the sun at night. Now to see if you can pour your heart into something that cannot be seen, but is very much real. As you continue on your island challenge, consider what makes up the people and Pokemon that you meet, both what you can see and what you cannot. You will surely meet Tapu Koko again someday. I mean, I definitely have to battle this Pokemon at some... <laughs> at some point, right? Sorry. 
Uh. Tauros, what up, dude? Whoa there, boy. I've got an idea. How about I set you up so you can ride my Tauros whenever you'd like? Yeah. No reason why he shouldn't get to enjoy the island challenge, too. Yep. I'll take care of all the little things you'll need in order to ride a Pokemon, Misha. All the little things? Okay. A ride pager. Nice. I can page him whenever I want. Why don't you hop on there? Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm all saddled up. Looky there. Aw, oh, Nebby's out watching me too. The world looks a bit different from atop a mighty Tauros, eh? See, Misha? Here in Alola, our Pokemon lend us their strength and let us ride about on them. Let me explain some of the gear I gave you. Your ride pager is a tool that lets you summon a ride Pokemon. According to the instructions, you need only press the Y button to turn on your ride pager. Use the B button to dash. And your riding wear will be the special outfit you wear when riding Pokemon. Have a little romp around Alola with Tauros here. I'm sure you'll be charmed by him. When you use your ride pager, ride Pokemon will kindly come running to help you, to help you wherever you may be. Cool. So uh, hopefully, I mean, definitely there are going to be different types of ride Pokemon, but I'm interested to see like how you unlock them. If you have to catch them, um, or what? I'd assume you'd have to catch them, but you just get access to Hollas for for free. <clears throat> I hope you find your ride pager useful. I worked on developing it with a friend of mine. I'm amazed that you won without even using your Z power. <laughs> yep. Let's have a Pokemon battle when we next when next we meet. That's cool that he um he knew that I didn't use my Z power and if I had used my Z power, he probably would have I don't know, maybe complimented me on using my Z power or something. That's fun. Very well then. Off on your island challenge you go. May the future bring you happiness. Thank you, Captain. All right, Misha, with a little help from Tauros, you can smash right through those big rocks on Route 1. All right, I got a little something for you, too. Oh, TM54, False Swipe. False Swipe is a move that will leave your opponent with one HP when you attack. Keep on catching more and more Pokemon. Yeah, tell Rotom all about it. But first, you've got to go let your mom know what you're up to. When you're done with that, head on down to the marina. Um... And then once I get to the marina, I'll get to go to another island. Alright, time to get the boat ready. Lily, you gonna help me clean it? <laughs> oh, here's Lillian Cosmog. Oh, she wants to ask me a favor, I guess. You see, Nebby is... It's real home is far away from here, and I want to help it get home. It's like I told you before, Nebby saved my life once when I was in trouble. Now I want to save it. I feel like there's not much I can do on my own since I'm not a Pokemon trainer, but if I had a real trainer like you helping me, Misha, then maybe... But I probably shouldn't ask a near stranger to help, right? I know it's just my own wish and it has nothing to do with you. Of course I'll help. I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I'll help. Oh, thank you so much. I'm so glad. I really didn't know what else to do. Then I suppose the two of us will be heading to the next island as well. <laughs> Pew! Alright, so... Um... I will be going with them to the next island. So I need to go home, which is south, right? <laughs> yeah. Sorry, yeah, I mean, I just live south of Route 1. I don't know why that... <sighs> Brain farts. Aren't they the worst? Okay, so let's go on down home and tell Mom what we're up to. Oh, wait! I can ride Tauros. <laughs> Duh, there we go. Nice. Oh wait, so where are those rocks? Are they up here? No, that's Route 3. There are some rocks up in that that meadow. Um. Whew. So I guess, aw, I was gonna say, I wonder if I can go through grass without Pokemon attacking. <laughs> Oh, a Caterpie. I'm just gonna run from him. I don't really wanna... I don't know. Deal with it. <laughs> yeah, it's level 2. Aw, I feel so bad killing a little level 2 Pokemon. Um... I don't wanna run into a Pokemon. Okay, good. 
Oh, well, okay. Guess I'm home. <laughs> I thought there were rocks right there. But I was wrong. Alright, I will... Um, dismount. Alright, there we go. Actually, I'm gonna go heal my Pokemon real quick, and then I'll go tell Mom what I'm up to. <laughs> and then I will go to the... Um, the marina. I think once I, I tell my mom what's going on, then I will end this episode. It's been going on for a while, but I get to go to the marina and go to the new island soon. I'm so excited. Okay, let's go tell mom. Can't believe I forgot where my house was. How dare I. Of course all these boxes are still everywhere. <laughs> you cleared the grand trial, right? I think Akala Island is up next. If you want to go there, maybe the marina has a ship. Oh yeah, did you check out Tin Carrot Hill? Oh, near the Pokemon Research Lab? I heard there are rare Pokemon there. So come on, spill the beans. How far have you gotten? I'm talking about the island challenge, of course. Okay. Thanks, Mom. So yeah, I need to go to Tin Carrot Hill. I will do that at the beginning of next episode before I go to um, the next island. Let me see. So, okay, yeah, it's down here. I guess this is Tin Carrot Hill? Like that volcano? Yeah, because there's the research lab and that's, I suppose, the hill. Hmm, cool. Well, I am excited to go see this Tin Carrot Hill and the Pokemon that are there. Apparently there's Rockruff there, which is what, what one NPC told me. Um, and I'm sure there's some other fun Pokemon there. And then I get to go to a new island. Oh my gosh. Thank you all so much for watching. How are you all liking the game? Please just, I don't know, tell me everything that you're experiencing. I really love uh, just hearing about how people are playing their game differently or different experiences. Um, yeah, if you want to follow my other social media, links are in the description box. You all have a wonderful day. Be kind to one another. And don't forget to be awesome. Bye!